Welcome ladies and gentlemen, Commodity TV, it's time for a news update. M2 Cobalt announced the launch of the 2019 work program, including up to 6,000 meters of drilling. This program is a continuation and expansion of the company's initial drill program launched last fall and includes both diamond and reverse circulation drilling. The company also plans to launch additional ground geophysics and rock grab samples and soil sampling within existing and recently acquired exploration licenses. M2 Cobalt also merged with Gerwa Mining, which is progressing very well. It is currently anticipated that the formal shareholder vote to approve the merger will be held in early mid-May 2019. As part of the merger process, the company has now satisfied all outstanding conditions for the drawdown of the 3 million US dollar working capital facility from and will utilize funds from this facility to fund the continuation and expansion of its initial drill program and the next phase of exploration. M2 completed already over 2,000 meters of diamond drilling before the Christmas break in mid-December 2018. Most of this drilling occurred at high priority targets at their Kilimbe area properties. In addition, they drilled four holes with 839 meters at the Bombo Northwest and Bombo targets at Bujagali. The assay results from the drilling have now been received. The results have provided important technical data and included a number of positive indicators, including sulfide mineralization at the targets tested in the Kilembe area, as well as the Bombo targets. The results are, conf uh, are con also confirmed the presence of ultramafic bodies at Bombo. However, as yet no material intersections have been encountered. With the funds available under the working capital facility, the company will now complete and expand their initial drill program in and around their Varachi and Nile targets with up to 3,000 meters of drilling plant to, the, to systematically test the large regional cobalt copper geochemical, geochemical anomaly discovered across their Bujagali licenses during 2018. Simon Clark, CEO of the company, stated, we are pleased to be able to complete and expand our initial drill program and to launch our next phase of exploration. We have a very large asset base with numerous large-scale targets and significant potential for new discoveries. The ability to leverage what we have learned to date into this expanded phase of drilling strengthens our position significantly. We are also extremely pleased to be able to add the technical and financial resources of Gerwa as we move through the merger process and combine operations, he said. M2 can finally restart with a lot of work, a good technical part uh, partner and drills are turning. Ladies and gentlemen, White Gold announced their fully funded 2019 exploration program on their 439,000 hectare land package. The exploration program has a budget of approximately $13 million and has been designed to follow up on the company's new high-grade vertical discovery on the J.P. Ross property, expand the Golden Saddle and Arc resources with diamond drilling on the GS West discovery and other nearby targets and increase the recently acquired 230,000 ounces VG resource and as well to identify and test high priority regional targets. White Gold is backed by their partners Agnico Eagle Mines and Kinross Gold and the 2019 exploration program is planned to commence in the coming weeks. Sean Ryan, Chief Technical Advisor stated, 2019 will be one of the most exciting seasons for White Gold and has the potential to be a transformative year for us. Our systematic regional exploration approach is working exceptionally well and resulted in four new discoveries last year. This year's program will also feature diamond drilling on the vertical discovery to expand this new unique style of high-grade gold mineralization. Concurrently, the regional program on the J.P. Ross property will follow up on multiple other highly anomalous gold targets near the Henderson Creek drainage system, where placer gold mining has been taking place since the turn of the century, and will continue to utilize detailed soil sampling, GT probe, and wrap drilling on high probability targets, which we anticipate will lead to more new discoveries. The Golden Settle deposit will be moved along with more diamond drilling on the GS West and Ryan's surprise discoveries. The recently acquired VG deposit will undergo drilling to expand the known resources and we will be applying our proprietary regional exploration program to advance some of our other priority targets. All in all, this should be our best season yet, said Sean Ryan. White Gold produced so far top results from their drillings and we are curious on more. Thanks for watching us and bye bye from Switzerland.